Rammstein never sounded better on any format. What we do here is go back, 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 back. Hello friends and welcome to my new video. It's Saturday morning here in Germany and I'm super excited. Um, the December is actually one of the craziest months of the year because so many great vinyl box sets, reissues and all kind of other Christmas stuff is getting available and um, yeah, uh, today a big parcel from Amazon arrived just a few minutes ago and I can't wait to share my impressions. Of course, I'm talking about the Rammstein box set. Finally, they decided to release uh, something like that. I was really looking forward to it and I was always hoping that the albums are getting available on vinyl because um, actually only a few of them uh, are available and they are very expensive and there are also some uh, counterfeits and fake pressings. So I'm really happy that the band or the management decided to release a huge box set. Um, so today I will do a little unboxing, a little review and uh, I will give my uh, thoughts about the box set and also some personal story uh, I share with the band and I can't wait to start. Let's go! Alright, so here is the huge parcel, very big package and I'm super excited to open it. Um, I can't wait to see what's inside. Okay, so it's a classic box in the box. And here it is. So I can tell you it's some really heavy shit. This is a huge box set, it looks great and it's very heavy. So it's limited to, I don't know how many copies, but I got number uh, 9906. Okay, let's open this uh, thing up. So the sticker says, Caution uh, Hot Wax, uh, 21st anniversary box set, the complete catalog remastered on vinyl for the first time. Seven double LP sets on 180 gram heavyweight vinyl, gatefold sleeves featuring the original album artwork, including rare tracks and all kind of other stuff. And this box, I mean, box uh, feels so good and it's some really heavy shit. Um, by the way, I paid uh, 250 euro for this one. It's the most expensive uh, box set or vinyl I bought ever. And to be honest, uh, I think it's a little bit too expensive, but you know, with uh, Christmas money and um, all kind of stuff, it was uh, doable. So let's see. Let's get the albums out. And I mean, this is really some quality stuff, I have to say. Great box set, um, fantastic stuff. Here's the back. Um, yeah, and I mean, you got all albums, uh, the complete, um, the complete catalog, uh, Herzleid of course. This is uh, Sehnsucht. Mutter. Reise, Reise, and I can feel this is a great textured um, artwork. Uh, this is uh, Rosenrot. Liebe ist für alle da, the last album, and last but not least also some rarities, raritäten. I'm really curious uh, for this one. So yeah, um, 
I will take my time and uh, listen to the albums of course and I will let you know about the quality but I'm super excited I mean finally they reissued it a great band I first discovered them in the early 2000s um, right after Sehnsucht was uh, released or yeah yeah I think so um, fantastic group I never got the chance to see them live but um, I will do that for sure if they go on tour again and actually I can't wait to put on the first record so I'll keep you updated well friends a few hours later wow <laughs> what a trip I didn't listen to all albums but uh, I checked all records and uh, I listened to some of them focused and I'm blown away I have to say fantastic quality sound wise pressing wise and uh, overall in general um, yeah, I had high expectations, I have to say, because the price is really, I mean, 250 euro, that's a lot of money, but the pressing quality is perfect, the remaster is breathtaking, actually, it sounds so good, so powerful, dynamic and energetic, um, Rammstein never sounded better on any format, I listened to some originals at a friend's house, I also have all, all the albums on CD, and I think I once listened to a fake pressing and what can I say um, they uh, cut the, the lacquers at Sterling Sound in New York City and actually I don't know who the remaster did but it's fantastic um, it's um, how should I say it um, it's interesting that they released a vinyl box set and no CD box set so the, the remaster is specially for vinyl and whoever uh, whoever did the remaster uh, knew his job and it's fantastic. Um, I didn't have any warped records, um, perfect quality and what I also love is that every single album has um, a massive booklet and uh, inserts and everything. Um, perfect quality really. Especially the first album which I expected to sound a little lower but no it's not the case. It sounds perfect. Um, it was really much fun. I would almost say that this is one of the best sounding yeah, metal uh, or hard rock uh, albums ever. Um, of course, musically it's somewhere in between metal, industrial metal, they really have their own style, but I'm so impressed by the sound quality and I had really high expectations. Uh, I'm so happy um, that this is some quality stuff and uh, I'm repeating myself, but I really like the um, the booklets, um, fantastic job, uh, I love all the pictures and this is like, um, yeah, that's like a dream come true really for a fan, it couldn't uh, it couldn't get any better actually. Um, I also listened to the Rarities uh, double album, um, it has some tracks from uh, Liebe ist für alle da, also some unreleased stuff and I really like the full band version of Los which was featured on the Reise Reise album, perfect. I mean, the only thing they could have done better, um, the records come in uh, paper inner sleeves. Of course, I replaced them with some uh, with some polylined inner sleeves. But overall, I mean, they also here it's textured, so it feels really good. Great, great stuff. Um, high price, but. Uh, I'm totally satisfied uh, with it. I also like uh, the fact uh, this album, Liebe ist für alle da, it was censored in Germany. Um, there is a song on it uh, that features heavy violence, I don't know, it's always the same story, but um, fortunately uh, it's uncensored, it has the uncensored booklet and also the song is on it. Uh, I won't show the pictures because I uh, will get blocked on YouTube then, but um, yeah, overall, I can highly, highly, highly recommend the box set. I don't know the limitation, but I guess it will be around 15,000, 20,000, something like that. But, um, yeah, uh, get it while you can. I'm sure this will be one of the, of the craziest Christmas presents. Um, I have a lot of memories. Um, I was first listening to Rammstein when playing Unreal Tournament back in the early 2000s and there was this map called Eifersucht which is of course a track by Rammstein and uh, that's how I got into them and I mean the lyrics, the music is so evil in a way and 
it really makes me proud that it's one of the one of the German bands that uh, are famous worldwide actually and yeah great stuff I mean Mutter what an album I mean and by the way I also want to add I like the fact uh, that they uh, only release the uh, albums in the box set so you can't buy the single albums actually I like the idea about that because um, of course the band will make more money but um, you get all albums um, at one time and I mean that's just fantastic what a great box set. I'm really happy and I can't wait to spin the other albums and spin the first album again. Yeah, I'm really blown away. Uh, this is like, this is perfect, perfect quality. Um, I had so many bad examples in the last time when records were warped or I don't know, the quality wasn't right, but this time, yeah, fantastic. Well, that's it for today. Uh, thanks for watching. Feel free to like, comment and subscribe. Uh, leave a comment uh, about the box set. Did you order your uh, copy for yourself? Um, I will uh, continue listening now and yeah, have a great day, evening, night, whatever, weekend. <laughs> See you next time. Bye bye.